I'm sorry for violating you in the face to face. You just lie about everything. You're a great troll. You're a great liar. And I know you don't think you're gonna this fight. You know everybody she dated? There's like five of them. Well, it's, that's the thing. My gag reflex is pretty strong. Okay. Yeah, okay. I have to say. Okay. It'll take, it'll take, okay. take a lot. Okay. okay. She belongs to the streets. So recently, the long-awaited Dylan Danis Logan Paul face-to-face -face went live, and when I watched this, I genuinely realized that Logan Paul has new levels of brain damage, and the way he acted in that face-to-face, -face, he was acting like Dylan is the villain, and Logan is the person who's on top of the world better than everyone, who has the most fans and all of that stuff. You know, someone who is probably the most annoying type of person in the world, and I genuinely think he's an idiot, because of the amount of hypocrisy I heard in this face-to-face -face was out of this world. Yeah, guys, if you're new to the channel, please be sure to leave a like on the video, subscribe to notifications, and be sure to check out the first link in the description and join the group. It's not a scam, unlike Logan Paul's entire existence. But yeah, let's just get into this. This is about to get stupid. Explain this, real fighter. What happened here? Yeah, because I'm like a man. I fought six guys, and when your brother got confronted by six guys, he ran away like a... So what, what happened here? I just told you. No, explain it to me. Now, this first attempt from Logan is him showing a picture of Dylan getting attacked by multiple people, which one of them eventually put him in a chokehold. And when he explains it to Logan, and then Logan realizes that his roast has completely failed because Dylan just revealed the backstory behind that, he immediately starts acting stupid and completely ignores what Dylan just said and keeps saying, oh, what happened here, real fighter? Explain this, real fighter. Yeah, because I'm like a man. I fought six guys. And when your brother got confronted by six guys, he ran away like a... What, what happened here? You know, it's one of the most annoying and retarded shit I've seen. This guy genuinely has brain damage, bro. I can't with this. You're no. obviously a scumbag. You want to you do half a foot. You're obviously a piece of one that's a piece of Now, throughout this whole face-to-face, -face, Logan calls Dylan a scumbag, a liar, a shit person, and all of that, which I think is the most laughable and the most hypocritical shit he could ever say. And now, obviously, he thinks he's the main character, he's the main guy, so he can call anyone anything, and no one can call him anything. He will just laugh at them and completely ignore their point. You know, as I said, those type of people are actually so stupid. And I see a lot of people on the internet saying, oh yeah, but Dylan isn't any better. He still fell for CoffeeZilla's video where he actually promoted a scam or whatnot. But I think that is so mild compared to Logan Paul's scamming over a million dollars off of people who invested in his crypto thing and then even later in the interview he says that he's working on those issues but dylan is not working on those issues or whatever which makes no sense because first of all i don't think logan is working on anything he's just an absolute idiot and yeah bro my brain hurts from all of this it's so painful you are a f***ing scumbag you're a piece of sh you're a piece of of sh you are a I'm dirty f***ing Asshole. Yeah, I feel like Logan should be saying this to himself in the mirror. I'm like, where, 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 where do you find boy? these gremlins? How do you find 1,500 gremlins to have sex with you? How many exes when does your, your girlfriend hook have? up with Dylan Dennis, how, how many, how many she go, they go to the confession box and <laughs> confess to the priest because that is a sin that can never be forgiven. All right, all right. Now he tries to shame Dylan for sleeping with a lot of women, which again, probably know where I'm going, is the most hypocritical stuff I've ever seen on the internet. Don't make me roll it, bro. Don't make me roll it. Okay, here we go. You know everybody she dated? There's like five of them. Well, it's, that's the thing. My gag reflex is pretty strong. Okay. Yeah, okay. I have to say. Okay. It'll take, it'll take, okay. take a lot. Okay. <laughs> she belongs to the streets. Yeah, this was basically the entire face-to-face -face in a nutshell. Dylan actually did way, way better than Logan, in my opinion. He actually had valid roasts, and all that Logan did was just laugh at them and then completely ignore them, you know? It's some very, very annoying and boring shit. Now, honestly, I just hope Dylan wins the fight, because I know a lot of people have been saying that there's no chance that Dylan wins and Logan will win, which there is a high probability that happens, but, you know, I'm just cheering for Dylan. And if he actually beats Logan, that would be insane, you know? That would make everything move in the correct shelves, and Logan Paul... Will Will become the absolute clown of the internet and i really want that to happen because this guy has made himself the most unlikable person in 2023 quite literally you know it's quite crazy to see but yeah guys give me your thoughts on this in the comments below be sure to click one of the videos on the screen right now that's it and i'm out